If this is your first time, please uh, take a second to subscribe to the channel. Um, hi, it's Brad here from Ditch the Grind. Welcome to the channel if this is your first time, and if it's not, then welcome back. So when it comes to affiliate marketing, you may have already watched some videos about it here on YouTube. No doubt you've seen all of these so-called gurus flashing about in their Lambo, Lambos or their Porsches or their Ferraris, or throwing around hands full of cash. Pretty cheesy, I think. But for the most part, it is in fact a bunch of bullshit. Not to discredit the art of affiliate marketing, but the reality is most of these so-called gurus m actually make their money by selling noobs some shit that they don't really need. But it is possible to make money with affiliate marketing and it is possible to make a lot of money with affiliate marketing. Um, the only thing is it's not as easy as they make it seem. Uh, so there were a, like a number of affiliate marketplaces. This is where you would go to find products to sell. Um, ClickBank is one that's been around for a long time. Amazon Associates, you're f no doubt familiar with uh, Amazon. Um, JVZoo is another one. Um, the other way that you can find affiliate products to sell is if you go to Google and search products that you like and scroll down the page and see if they have an affiliate, an affiliates tab. If they do, the chances are that you can sell something. And the good thing about selling products that you already use and you like is you have genuine first-hand experience with that and no doubt it's something that you have uh, like an, an interest in and if you do if you really like it then it can show in the way that you present yourself in whatever means it is that you choose to drive traffic to their offer um, and there was a time once upon a time where you could just take the sales page that you will get when you were a, when you sign up for one of these affiliate offers they give you like a bunch of resources. Sales pages are one of them. And there was a time when you could take one of these sales pages and just start to throw a bunch of traffic at it and you would get a sale. That was a while ago. It doesn't really work like that anymore. And that's thanks to a bunch of scamming pricks that have gone out there and just completely tainted the whole industry. Nowadays, the most effective way is to build a relationship with your ideal customer. And you can do this by driving traffic to an offer that people are happy to give you their email address and their details in exchange for. The money is in the list, and this is a phrase that if you haven't already heard before, now that you're just starting to embark on this journey, you are no doubt gonna hear over and over again, and there is a lot of gravity held to that statement, because it's true. First, you build a list of potential buyers, and you start the process of giving them value. Um, however it is that you choose to do that, it could be through YouTube videos. I really like YouTube, it's taken me personally a while to start my own channel. Um, this is only one of the very first few videos that I've decided to put together. Um, but I've made a lot of videos in the past where it's been me on the on this side of the camera making videos for video ads, driving traffic to affiliate products. Now the whole idea is you want to get your so-called like uh, your um, the the traffic that you generate people that have an interest in what it is that you might be saying is you want to get them to know, like, and trust you. Um, again, it's one, of the, it's one of those phrases that you'll hear again, especially if you follow me, I will use that a lot. And these are, it's a term that I've gotten from a bunch of people that I follow and they know what it is that they're doing. So um, once they know, like, and trust you, they become more likely to buy from you if you yourself continue to give value. So there's driving traffic. Um, as I mentioned before, driving traffic through paid ads. Um, what I like to use is Facebook ads, YouTube ads, uh, Google ads not so much, although YouTube ads are run through Google ads. Um, so the interface is much the same. Um, Microsoft ads as well, which was formerly known as Bing ads. It, it, again, it operates much the same as, as Google ads. Um, however you decide to do those pay-per-click methods, they call them. Um, and then there's also organic traffic, which is mostly through organic uh, content creation. Uh, again, like YouTube with this video, this is or organic reach. So <clears throat> people that are looking, in this case, for a solution to a problem that they have or looking for a way to answer a question that they might have. That is, I'm creating content right now for you to consume. And hopefully, if I'm doing my job right, you are getting some sort of value 
um, you are getting an answer to a question that you have or a solution to a problem. In which case, if you are, please take a moment to give me a, a like. And if you haven't subscribed already, then please do that as well. Um, yeah, so basically that in a nutshell is affiliate marketing for beginners. Uh, from here, I'm gonna start to create more and more videos around the topic too. Uh, so please keep an eye out for um, number two in the series. Again, if you subscribe and you click the notification bell, when that comes out, you'll be able to click straight to it and I hope to see you there. Thanks.